You have prophetic dreams that came to the Prophet Sallallahu and even sometimes uh, visions. And so he's in a waking state, uh, maybe in his prayers, uh, sometimes in an intense type of meditative uh, position, doing his dhikrullah, and a type of visions would come to him. And so some of the hadith here are based upon these visions. And he basically interpreted this as a person would in those times. But we today have another perspective. And in looking at that, there's an interesting um, hadith which is authentic in Ibn Hibban uh, series. And the Prophet ﷺ said in translation, toward the end, there will be men from my ummah who will ride on something like comfortable saddles. Now think of the concept of a saddle. They will ride on this something like a comfortable saddle. That's what he's seeing. They will dismount at the doors of the masjid. And their women will be clothed, yet naked. So think about this and think about some of the so-called advanced Muslim countries. He was more than likely looking at a, a, looking at a car, a vehicle. Because it's, and then uh, going right up to the masjid, generally speaking, um, people did not ride their animals right up to the side of the masjid. The animals, you know, uh, go to the bathroom. The animals, you know, there's a pen for the animals. So you don't go right up to the masjid. Okay? But today, uh, in our vehicles, uh, we go right up to the masjid, and then we get out. And unfortunately, the, the styles of today uh, have influenced everybody, including Muslim women. And those styles really got into motion uh, in the 60s, especially when they introduced that fabric uh, spandex. So when they introduced this uh, uh, type of um, elastic type of material, and so you could wear tights, so you were actually covering your body in a sense, but the body is completely described. And so he is describing this as a person in the Arabian Peninsula. They're clothed. There's, there's cloth covering the whole of their body, but they're naked. So this is what he's seeing. And so this is interesting from our perspective because this is a prediction about what we are witnessing today.